Hello everyone, it's me again. In front of us here we have the Bat Stove 2.0 and just a tartar sauce holder. And the reason why is because I'm curious if this may burn faster than the Bat Stove, which I really love that stove and I've been using it a lot. But I'm entertaining the idea of building my own remote stove and something with possibly a bigger flame. So, well, I sorry, I should elaborate on that. A bigger flame in terms of a bigger burning surface because I have bigger pots that I like to use when I have two or more when we are hiking and, and, and camping. So I want something that's a little bigger. So I was a little curious. So in each stove right now, I measured out one ounce of alcohol, um, basically methyl hydrate, that's what I use. And in each honey pot, uh, the usual two cups of water. So I'm going to start the timer once I light these guys. Of course, this one, I'm going to have to wait for it to bloom. And this one, I can put the pot right on right away because that's what I'm going to do when I'm out and about. All right, so here we go. Um, I'll light this guy first because we know it needs to bloom. Okay, I'm going to put this guy right on right away because I know I can. Let's cap him. I'm actually just going to turn off the lights, I guess. Actually, that might not be a smart idea because I probably can't put the honey pot on properly. Let's see what happens. I'm already bumping around. No priming on this guy. There we go. The batch still feels a lot hotter. Yeah, it's quite a bit hotter. Close, there's your six minute mark. Don't think there's any bubbling at all, but I'm just gonna take a sneak peek. Oh, actually, yeah, you got little bubbles on this guy, but it's not a rolling bowl oh, yet. This guy is a little bit less. Interesting. It's taking longer to boil inside than it was outside with the windscreen, but they're lasting longer. <laughs> That's interesting. There's 11 minutes in, okay? And I'll pop this guy off too. They're still going. There you go. It just started bubbling. And this one on the right is not quite doing it yet. It's 
got little bubbles, but I want it like that. Still going though. Yeah. Guess we just got really cold water here in Canada. <laughs> Yep, the one on the right still not. Oh, the one on the left went out at, I would say, about 12 minutes. Just a teeny bit past that. And this guy's still going. He's still got fuel. Still going, but it just won't quite boil it yet. Shall we cap it? Interesting. So the open flame design will burn longer. By how much more? Let's find out. Back and cool down, I'm gonna have some hot chocolate later. Hey folks, so we are now at the 18 minute mark and it's still going. And as you see, I took off the other pot already to make my hot chocolate. And it still hasn't reached that bowl I want it to be at, but it's doing its thing. It's kind of bubbling. I'm going to turn on the light now, okay? Still going, all right? And this is what we have. So it's... It's bubbling and all, but it's just not, not giving me that nice, strong, rolling boil that I want at the moment. Let's see if it will achieve it. We, we just hit 19 minutes. Now. That's pretty impressive. Still going. Oops. <laughs> so it might have hit it just a little bit after 19 minutes. There we go. That's what I'm looking for. Wow. All right. Let's see how much more longer it'll burn. We are now reaching 22 minutes and it's still doing its nice boil. Okay, it's just gone out, and it went out at, it's 22.30 right now, I'd say it went out maybe about uh, 10 seconds ago, so, yep, there you go folks, that burned for 22 minutes and 20 seconds with one ounce of methyl hydrate, that is pretty amazing, boil time was reached at about 19 minutes for the rolling boil, it started bubbling a long time ago, probably at about, you know, 11 minutes, a little bit earlier than that, just like that guy, but it took a long time to reach that full boil. So I'm a little curious, maybe this weekend I can go and pick up some carbon felt and dump it in and see if it'll improve the boiling time and make the uh, flame pattern a little more consistent. Something I noticed during this is that, you know, sometimes it'd be a little bit smaller and a little bit larger. and I think um, definitely windscreen would help you know keep the flame shooting straight up but regardless if you're looking I think if I'm looking for something to do some cooking with uh, that's pretty impressive it's 22 minutes and uh, reaches the boil at 19 keeps going for a good three minutes on the boil so 
there you have it guys leave your comments and suggestions because I think I'm going to try building something that suits my needs see you guys later